Okay, today this is an open box review on this Sidelight SL150. I have the 100 I ordered prior and I returned it because I was using a smaller tiny silver battery. Uh, and this one has a bigger battery and apparently it's more powerful because I need to um, scope zero or bore side this at a 300 yards for the 338 Lapua and let's see how this looks let's look at the box first so if you guys, guys can read the box some people like the box okay you can hit pause and then read the box People like the box. Okay. And that's what it looks like. So pamphlet in here. Okay. And here's the box. Nothing on that side. Let's put this box away here. Just a little plain flip here. Laser here. Laser here and point and different stuff. So this is a default one if you place this target 25 feet from the muzzle and point the laser location and then you calculate where the cross is like I said you guys can hit a pause and read this okay it says point laser Okay, there's the little warning label. So the most important thing is to lubricate the O-rings with Visaline or silicone grease before each use, before damaging the O-ring. In here there is a target. Elevation leveling target kit with low in there. Okay. Don't use gun oil since it will damage the o-ring. So just Vaseline or grease. Okay. Here's the owner's manual. Each size of O-ring, with different calipers. So mine is 330A. 330A is this one. And it says A means I have to place this right here at A using this O-ring. A right there. 330A. Okay, I think I will try that. And here is the piece. Okay, come with two O-rings on it already. So the camera can zoom and focus on this piece. Here's on and off switch. On the other side, it's the identical. It's weighted down, so you just, as you hold it, it will naturally weight it down. Okay. 
I believe there's a magnet in here to suck onto the barrel. And I, the reason I like this is because the O-ring in the back is very tight against inside the barrel. The other cheaper ones, it will move. So as this move or it hangs down, not exactly tight fit, it will point the laser at the wrong direction. Okay, so there's that one. Come with all the O-rings. Okay. Count two fasteners. And you can basically just screw this on like so. Remove that guy. For me, we'll have to remove this guy and place one of the O-rings here to get the pool going. Okay. And here's another prism. I believe this one is the one that makes the laser shoots in the line, indeed. Makes the laser shoot in the line so you can level the laser. Rotate it however you want to. It's pretty cool. And you point the laser right here. Okay, I think that's it. As for the testing, I gotta shoot around the room. I have to say, this is about the same type currently, about the same amount of power for this laser as the 100 series if it just from my eye looking at it I have to try to shoot this later tonight at 300 yards see if I can still read this laser well 300 yards this laser disappeared into a blob of red so we have to try that if it doesn't work I'll return it and try to try to get a 500 series and the 500 series is the green laser, which is even more powerful. I have a bunch of green lasers for my late, uh, rifle. It can shoot about 300 yards and still solid green. So, uh, okay, I just tested out that's 300 yards out of my window. Um, about 150 yards, 100, 200 yards, you can still read the, um, red dot but about 300 yards you can see it um, and this is a sunny bright daylight so um, under the sun it means if I had the range a hundred yards you can see the you can see the red but it's very faint and when the hot air is moving around you might have a hard time to track this guy. So, I think I might return this and get the green one, get a 500 series. Here's the battery. Let's take a look what kind of battery this is. This is a back of the key for one of the gun case. Actually, it has a perfect profile in a flat, so it won't scratch the case. For the cover, for the battery cover. Okay, so this is a a dual cell, larger battery, CR two. See if the camera can pick it up. Okay, kind of faint it out. Okay, yeah, I think I will return this and get a 500 series. I will use mostly in, during the day, daytime, um, instead of indoor or nighttime use. Thanks for watching.